<laughs> you can't see it, Anna, but I'm next to Mr. Alwindi, who has Colonel Gaddafi's hat on his head, a Colonel Gaddafi's, well, I don't know what you call this, but it's a sort of uh, a, a, a Masonic sort of... Um, bushy thing yeah, that he exactly. used to throw around and, and his necklace. Now, where have you been, Elwindy? Uh, well, I've been in the Western uh, uh, Mountains since uh, four months ago. I was fighting Gaddafi troops uh, in Kikla and other places of, and parts of Libya. And now, I, this is the first day uh, after four months from struggling against Gaddafi troops. And I'm, I'm really proud for, from, for this moment that, that the Libyans have waited for 42 years and, I, I, and I'm going to give this to my dad uh, as a prison because he used to, he, he has suffered a lot from Gaddafi and Gaddafi policy. Tell me how you got the hat and where uh, well, you <laughs> I mean, it suits you. It was, where it was, did you get it from? It was really pretty hard. I, um, I just went inside his room, which Turn was, was Gaddafi's a, bedroom. Yeah, yeah Gaddafi's yeah. bedroom. And I, it was a... Uh, it was really, I was like, oh my God, I'm, I'm in Gaddafi's room. Oh my God. But then, then this thing happened. I found this. I, I was like, oh my goodness. But I'm happy now. I'm having this thing. And I'm, I'm happy for Libyans, for, for those people who have suffered a lot. And I, I really thank all, all the countries that have stood with us, that have given us uh, the, uh, the, happy, uh, uh, the help and, and support.